Hello, my name is Rodrigo Rada de Vera Jr. from BSB AHRD M22. And the materials that I'm going to use are these three kinds of paint brushes. And the paints I'm going to use are these colors. Um, this one is it says Prussian blue. If you can see it, thank you. If you can't, I'm so sorry. Can you see it? Prussian blue. Color white. Color black. Vermilion. Lastly, the cereal and blue. And we can forget about my paper or my canvas. Without further ado, let's do the painting. First, let's put the color vermilion. Apply the paint as much as you desire to get this kind of color. Next, let's put the color white. Putting color white into your artwork helps you to blend with the other colors. You can mix the color vermilion and white to make a lighter color of vermilion. After you do the blending of vermilion and white, now apply the color cerulean blue and blend it with light also. Blend it well until you get the gradient you wanted you can now apply the color prussian blue onto the top of the canvas make sure that the prussian blue and the cerulean blue is well blended the color that i use in the mountains are cerulean blue white and prussian blue make sure that the color of the each mountain is from light to darkest It's okay not to do a perfect triangle to make it look like a real mountain. After you finish the mountain, Let's try to make the forest beside or before the mountain. I use the color black paint to show the silhouette of a forest because it is going sunset. Polishing some parts of the forest to make it look good and realistic. After finishing the forest, splash some white paints on the top of your artwork to look it as a stars it's done isn't look good Ta -da! this is my painting thanks for watching